Hello everyone and welcome back to Dune. We're still fighting the battle for dominance over Dune, but before we continue, we are going to look for some new sieges. So we're going to go to... So we're also oh, we're actually here, so... Let's just... Oh, we actually got a new message, so <laughs> let's ignore that and... Let's see who would like to speak us here. Oh, it's Jenny. Paul, 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 Paul. I'm so happy. So happy, so happy, so happy. I've, managed I've managed to cure, to cure everybody, everybody here. here. Paul, 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 Paul. I'm so happy. That's actually pretty good because those are our fighting troops and wouldn't be good if those would be attacked while we are busy. Select destination on map. So let's go to... Yeah, let's go to the southeast. Yes, so it wouldn't be good if those would be attacked while they're sick. I don't know if that actually happens, or whether the game scripts it in a way that those troops get spared. But if if so, I could lose my entire army, so that's that's not good. So for now, let's look for some sieges. So there's there's different ways to find sieges. You can always check out the spice map, because every siege has on an area allocated around it, and if let's say an entire area is covered in spice areas, then there will be no other siege, even though there could still be a smuggler village. But it's, it doesn't really work that way all the time because there are certain areas of Dune where there's just desert. There's no spice area, there's no siege allocated. There's one where there's a siege that you can't access by normal means due to a bug. And you have to use a hex editor to access it. So this method is not perfect, so keep that in mind. And the best way to be honest is to find the siege and then reload and find it again quicker. This seems cheap, but then again the game really has a hard limit because you can run out of spies. And you also get punished for spending too much time doing stuff that you don't really need to do. So yeah, mm -hmm. a little bit mixed here. It's it's true that you, on the one hand, it, you should explore and everything. On the other hand, the game only gives you so many opportunities to actually do that before it just says, ah, and you're out of spice and you lose or the Harkonnen just just overrun you so yeah keep keep that in mind so oh yeah here we go wait a minute i'm not sure i think i've just seen a siege on the right yep let's go there so let's skip to the destination so always keep in mind that you should have someone with you to to spot sieges but you're probably going to have someone with you at all times anyway oh Careful, mate, you're falling off that platform. So let's talk to this guy here. I can feel something in you. Nevertheless, I cannot say if you will be able to bring good to our people. Oh, damn, it's, it's Elvis Presley. Man, look at that hair. It's perfectly black. It's perfectly black. And look at those, those sideburns and those eyebrows. Holy hell. So... No, I'm not very confident in your chances of success. The Harkonnens are too well armed. Well, that's a shame, really. No, no, wait. We'd rather you didn't visit our siege. There's nothing here for you to see. I'm totally not hiding the giant reservoir of water there. Yeah, this is really a shame, but... Well, it's, it's still not a waste. I can recruit this guy later. Let's ca call a warm. They should, they, they should be another siege around here somewhere. I think there's one to the... Yeah, I remember being one of this drop-shaped uh, structure there, so let's go to the northeast. Yeah, there should be uh, another one there. To be honest, even if you know where these sieges are, they're not that easy to find. And even if you have experience with the game, there's only so much that gives you because, I mean, if you, I guess you can try to remember the entire map of the game, but that would be quite the feat, so, yeah. But, oh well, for now. Yeah, one other thing, I don't know if I've talked about it, but in my opinion, it's generally best to have your largest farming groups be army troops, because army strength, there's only so many troops you can use at the same time, so you want to have as many guys in there as possible. And for spice mining, if you have a larger troop, uh, they will harvest either faster or more, I presume. But then again, there's only so much spice anyway, so 
if you have medium sized troops doing that you generally have enough spies and there's no hard limit there you can just have a couple of troops and have them mine area after area so there's no real reason to always use the strongest troop and you can just have one troop well not one troop maybe that's just that's too little but have several troops just move from from area to area when one area is devoid of spies and with the armies that's not really true you want to have as much firepower as you can get concentrated which is why you have, want to have large groups of fremen that are well trained and have all the equipment you need and speaking of which I think I did buy a couple of waiting modules. I'm not entirely sure. I think, at least I think there were some available. You definitely want to get those, get everything, get Chris knives, less guns and waiting modules. Even though to be honest, the Fremen in, in the Dune books, they didn't use many less guns. They did use them, but not as a traditional weapon. Also because if a shield is hit by a less gun, the explosion is essentially like a tactical nuclear explosion. So that is, quite a devastating weapon if you don't use it carefully which is too much kind of nice which does explain why there's not everybody using shields and not everybody using less guns at all times so there's this drop shaped kind of structure which is close to this could actually be in Harkonnen territory so I will see but if, if it is Stilgar will give you it will give me a warning or us a warning so we should still be good. If that's the case, I'm probably just going to look for another siege. I think there's a total of three around here. But uh, we'll see. So for now, let's just travel a little bit further. And then let's change destination. Let's... Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Didn't want to move the map here. But I'm okay with that too. So, and it's the next day. Could also be that the siege is simply, well, not permanently hidden, but that we could just can't exit it, access it at this point. Oh, well, maybe we can. It looks like a siege there on the left. Well, good for me. So let's go there. And let's see whether these guys are more friendly. So, looks like this siege is abandoned. Let's go and see Chani. So, yeah, this one here is abandoned, which is okay. Because we can still, if you check out the dune map. So, spice density. So we still have a, a new area here, which you can now access for sparse harvesting. We also need to send prospectors there, but uh, we'll see about that. So oh, I guess we we can't. We are the spice prospectors. Okay, looks like we can contact them. So let's move them. Show me three sieges where you want me to go. So here, there, and as soon as we finish prospection here. We'll leave for this other siege. Yep, sounds good to me. Let's cut the contact. Oh, we've actually guys here. Let's see what these guys are up to. My troop is going back to our siege. We've found some Chris. That's good. So yeah, let's just cancel here for now. And let's exit the maps. And let's go back into the desert. And let's call for warm. So I actually think there's another siege to the east. So let's try to find that one as come. Let's try to find. Let's try to find that one as well. Yeah. So I, I don't remember all the siege locations, but I've looked for a couple, and occasionally also uh, need to reload because uh, at the very beginning I didn't really know what to do when I played this game for the first time, and at that point. Especially if you played on an actual console, it's really difficult because you can very easily end up in a situation where you have played for three or four hours and you've essentially played yourself into a corner. So this, I like this game, but occasionally the controls are a little bit cumbersome, but they're still pretty good for a console game. And I also think that the game can be a little bit ungrateful with regard to, or a bit unforgiving rather. 
but it's still it's still a fun idea and i wish there was a mix between the rts games and this game emperor is kind of like that with a tactile overworld map but not quite because there's no real there's no real overarching economy where you pay someone stuff like that that's not really in that game you of course do have your map economy but that's more like a tactical thing it's not really like a strategic thing but yeah we'll see maybe maybe they do that but then again i don't really know what the licensing situation is but i could imagine if they ever make that dune that other dune film they want to make since 2000 and whatever not the miniseries uh, essentially well i wouldn't really call it a remake of the dune the david lynch dune film because it'll probably just be another adaptation of the book so if that as well ever comes out or maybe another miniseries i would really like a tv series based on Dune. that would probably be the best format because the dune books are kind of lengthy but then again if they do release it there might be a, it might be a multi-part film which i don't really mind i don't mind if it's just padding well some people have criticized the hobbit for being a three-part film and admittedly i found occasionally there was padding in there but at the same time some some scenes were really really cut short like one the forest which it felt like it was over in five minutes and it felt like in the book that was one third of the book at least from what i remember but then again i haven't read the hobbit in ages so please please don't quote me on that but oh well so let's see what yeah no that wasn't another siege they we just game just froze there for a second which does happen but generally um frame rate is pretty good but it's a console game from the 90s so there shouldn't really be frame rate issues for many of these and most of the ones where there are such issues are ones where you have a lot of sprites on screen at the same time so here we just have our warm warming its way th through the desert so no need for a slowdown here and oh yeah there we go it looks like a siege there on the left all right so let's go there skip the destination let's see whether there's someone here mm, nope doesn't really look like it so we we have found a couple of sieges but there's, there's just no fremen there okay so let's call another warm Select destination on map. actually check out so we found the siege down here on the snake the snaky area here so i'm not quite sure were there other sieges around here I think no we found this one very south as well so you know what for now let's just return to actually let, let, let's see what we what we can buy here while we're already in the area so let's call another warm could have used the last one obviously but warms to tire as well so if you have a long journey you need several warms in universe here you can travel around the entire planet in one warm okay so w what is it now yep. okay saboteurs i don't really care about that let's just talk to our smuggler friend here well i prefer that you pay my last bill before i deal with you again okay so let's do let's do that so i guess we should really do that and let's call a warm so we still have a, a harvester here Select destination on map. so let's before we do that maybe let's just check out the map whether there's still troops in the area that do not have a harvester so you are training here let's actually go to the palace and pay the smuggler and i'm not quite sure how many days it is we have before the emperor asks for spice again but we'll see skip to destination he might just ask contact us soon anyway but we want to do some stuff in this area anyway so i'm not too concerned here so let's talk to duncan here are our current stocks of spice not too bad you can notice that yesterday we produced less spice than the day before what a shame see so we have to check our the spice next troops. demand from the emperor will be in two days uh, one moment. Yes, here it. Look at this bill. Do you want me to send that much spice to this smuggler? You're always so accusing, and you, your eyebrows. Why do they hate me? Anyway, let's just okay, do this. Okay, that'll be done. Okay, so 
that should be it for now. So let's just actually let's go into the desert to call it warm. And let's actually check out the dune map first. So we've got you here. We are doing military training. Here are okay. the characteristics of my troop. On trial, so large group but not very good. Would you like me to repeat what I said? We are doing military have a look. Okay, they don't the really have equipment, so let's group. see what they can search for equipment. Okay. Let's see where they go. We're going to search for some Chris. Sounds good to me. Let's actually check these guys here as well. It's been days since we've heard from you. Shani isn't with you? She's vanished. Nobody has seen her. That's not good. Chani has cured all of us, Moadib. That is good. There should still be a full stop at the end of that sentence. We are doing military training. Our ability is increasing. We are now efficient in military matters. That's good. Let me show you the statistics of my troop. I think I still want you to have more equipment. Okay. So what are you doing? We're going to search for some Chris. Okay, so let's see what these guys here have. It's been days since we've Chani isn't. Okay, Chani has We are doing have a look at the characters. So these have less guns group. and and Chris nice but no weirding modules. Chani isn't with you. Chani has We are doing Here are the characteristics of my troop. Okay, so let's let's actually go to the next smuggler and see what he has to offer. Whoops. So I need less guns and Weirding mod. Could you please come? Can, come on, just oh, there we go. So, oh, wait, others. So it looks like we actually have weirding modules there. So that's actually pretty good. So let's see which troop here is the strongest. We are doing military. May I show you the Expert. characteristics of my troop? Okay. Okay, that should be it. We're going to search for weirding modules. Okay, so once these guys here return with weirding modules, they will essentially be perfect. They have the highest training and they've got they've got the best equipment. So let's go here nevertheless. Because I want to see whether they have more weirding modules. Because we just need at least three more, but obviously even more later when we increase our army size and military equipment isn't that expensive compared to Orni's. Okay, so what do we have now? Please don't tell me we're under attack. A message, A message has arrived. Has arrived. Okay, that's interesting, but we'll see. First let's talk to this guy while we're already here. Good to see you. It's been many days. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have an Orny for trade. Here is my price for it. Nah, I don't really need that right now. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have weirding modules for trade. Here is my price. So let's argue a little bit here. Uh, weirding modules? At this price, I'm losing money. Okay, let's just accept it. It's not too bad. Okay. So it's always possible to come to an agreement, isn't it? Yes, essentially. It's yours now. Send someone to pick it up. Make sure that I get paid for this. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have a spice harvester for Nope. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have this thine with a thousand kilograms on it. I have an orny for trade. Well... Okay, so looks like we're not going to go anywhere here. Actually, so we... Oh, we do have an Orni here. Um, okay, let's actually check out the map where there's Orni free Fremen around here. I don't think you can give your military guys Ornies. So it looks like these guys... But what are these guys doing? Okay. <laughs> I don't know, pause are too low, blah blah blah. So we could go to that other smuggler. 
But I think we first want to go to the palace and we need to go and pay the Emperor soon anyway, so let's just call a warm. And let's go to the palace if I could actually select Yeah, there we go. There we go. Let's leave the fish. And go there. Let's try to find out what actually happened to Chaney. So, actually, you know what? Hmm. Select destination I might actually go to... I might actually go to the smuggler village first. And could you please allow me to select... You know what? Let's let's just do it this way. There we go. That's, that's a lot easier. This, this map is just more friendly. Let's try and uh, talk to this guy here again. So there's so there's more weirding modules there as well. That's pretty good. So let's fly there and let's see whether we can can buy even more. Okay, another message. This is probably the one from the emperor. Or oh, it's Duncan telling us to pay. We have finished our prospecting job. Okay, that's good. So still, first let's talk to this guy here. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have several laser guns for trade. Here is my price. That's pretty good. So let's argue maybe one more time. <laughs> laser guns of the highest quality at this price. I'm losing money. Yeah, 800 is not too bad, to be honest. Okay. So it's always possible to come to an agreement, isn't it? It's yours. Yep. Well... I have weirding modules for trade. Let's buy those as well. You've got a deal. It's your... Well, I have a spice harvester. Okay, we uh, don't really need that. A spice harvester of the highest quality. At this price, I'm losing money. 600. You know what? Let's just buy that. Okay. And let's actually see whether we can uh, use that for troops. Maybe in the future. Maybe if one gets eaten. Whatever. 600 isn't too much. So, let's fly back to the palace. Actually, let's see whether the prospectors are lurking around here somewhere. So, they are here. So, and let's also talk to these guys. We are doing military... Let me show you the statistics of my troop. Okay, so... Okay. Let's actually have to get these... Let have to just get some equipment. Okay. So let's see where these guys go now. We're going to search for yeah, that's pretty good. Guns. So let's see where these guys here need new instructions. We are the spice prospectors. Show me three sieges where you want me to go. I want you to go. Oh, come, yeah. I want. Please. Thank you. I want you to go there, and I also want to move this map here, so I can tell you to go there as well if that was yeah there we go so I wish I had a mouse here that should be that should be sufficient for now okay can always contact them later and I, th I think I should gain the ability to contact all Fremen soon anyway so it shouldn't be too bad all right that's said and done let's go to the palace and let's just fly there I'm not quite sure whether flying is actually faster than riding a worm. You'd think it is, but at the same time... Oh, we didn't even get the tag of inf informa um, animation, not information. Oh, well, anyway, let's let's pay the smugglers and then let's check out the message room. Here are... You can note the Emperor will call for a spice shipment tomorrow. Yep, that's all right with me. It's kind of annoying because I wish that... Uh, I didn't have to hang out here for that, so I can't really go all that far, but that's okay. Uh, one moment. Yes, here it is. Look at this bill. Do you want me to send... Okay, that'll be... Do remember that... Okay, so, but I did have another bill from a different one, so let's see whether I can pair that as well. Oops, that's not really what I wanted to do. I want to talk to Duncan again. Here, you can know... The Emperor... Uh, what... Yes, here it is. Look at this bill. 
Do you want me to? Guess we have okay, to talk to him done. several times. Let's stop, talk, stop talking and let's go to the communications room. Who's oh, from Fate Rauta? Okay. You look weird. Ah, your little darling is in my hands. I don't think you will see her again soon, little pup. That's not good. So we have to rescue her, obviously. Chani kidnapped by Fade Rafa Harkonnen. That's not good. Yeah, that's an understatement. We all like Chani a lot. I'm sure her disappearance will have a bad effect on the motivation of the Fremen troops. That is actually a true fact, so the Fremen motivation will drop, so we have to conquer some fortresses soon. And hopefully Chani will be in one of our common fortresses. So let's just... Whoop, that's not actually where I wanted to go, but never mind. So while we're here, let's actually check out how our troops are doing and whether they have moved a bit. So these guys are returning, that's good. So, and I think these guys here got their equipment. So these guys here, I, I try to, I will try to intercept. Can I talk to these guys? I cannot, or can I? Nope. So I will try to intercept these guys here on their way back and just send them north as well. So I have my army concentrated and then try to take over a couple of fortresses. We are doing military training. Okay, so let's see what they have. May I show you the characteristics of my troop? So I don't think I can find laser guns in all of the places around here. That's all right. Um, you could actually ask the smuggler again, but he might not have anything. So let's. Whoop! No, that's not what I wanted to do, but never mind. So let's actually. Now that we've paid him, he, I, then again, he might actually have. New stuff now that we have paid him. Let's let's see. So there are weirding modules. So I think the troops they they need Christmas and less guns first. So they won't they won't get all the advanced equipment first. So let's see whether you're fully equipped. We are doing. Here are the characteristics of my troop. Okay. So these guys should now be able to get uh, weirding modules. We're going yeah. to search for weirding modules. And these guys here, the other ones in the north, should be fully equipped. Weird. Let me show you the yeah, these are fully system. fully equipped. So that's said and done. Let's see whether the, this... Come on, just... Mm, let me please go to that smuggler village. Why is, why is this so difficult? So here we go. That should be possible. There we go. Skip to destination. And th that should be the message from the Emperor. Or rather from Tooth here, that the Emperor... Oh, no, it's not. There are seven. Yeah, whatever. I'm not going to bother sending troops there. It's just too, too cumbersome. Well, I have a spice harvester for trade. Nope, don't want that one. Uh, a spice harvester of the highest quality at... Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have an orange nope. for... Well... I have weirding modules for trade. Yeah, let's accept this as well. You've got a deal. It's a pleasure to do business with you. It's yours. Well, I have a spice nope. harvester. So it's just this well. again. So let's just stop talking and check out the map again. So let's see what we have here. So these guys here are the our eco guys. So these eco guys, I'm going to send those to the sieges where Nope, can't do that. Could send those to the siege where I've already housed all the spies, but we'll get to that for now. Let's just go back to the palace again. Maybe talk to our mom, that could be a good idea. Let's fly there. So there we go. And may as well... May as well... Whoops. 
I don't know what that was. I think game froze for a moment. May as well pay the smuggler while we're at it. Let's talk to Duncan again. Here are you can know the Emperor uh, Yes, here it is. Look at this bit Okay, that'll be done. So there we go. And then let's talk to our mom. And that should pretty much be whoops be it. The question is where is she? I th she could be oh yeah, she's in the in the garden chamber. There we go. You were invited to drink the water of life. Hmm. Oh yes. You were right not to try it. I've heard very little about it. Let me investigate. Okay, so I think whoop, that, that will be the Empress message. A message, A message has arrived. Okay, you know what? I'm going to pay the Emperor in between episodes because it's really not that not that thrilling. So thanks for watching and I shall see you next time. Take care and goodbye.